In this video, we will discuss nine ways men and women think differently. Though this list could be measured in miles, we'll stick with a more bite-sized version. This list comes from an article written by Anisha Nair in parenting.firstcry.com. And please tell me in the comments below which of these you agree or disagree with the most. Also, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate that. And check out the bonus fact at the end of the video. Now to the list. Number one. Women see the big picture while men have tunnel vision. And it comes down to brain function. In certain scenarios, men only use one of the brain's hemispheres while women use both, which means that women are better at multitasking while men focus on one task better. So if it felt like he wasn't listening while he was doing something else, he probably wasn't, but biologically he can't. So don't throw spoons at the poor guy for that, but keep that spoon close because he'll probably give you a reason to later in the day. Please comment below about your thoughts on the list and also like the video and subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate that. Number two, women tend to talk more than men and it's not just in quantity or by choice. When women describe something, they tend to do it in more flowery, sensual and descriptive terms. When describing a friend's garden, for example, a woman might say something like, oh, the azaleas were beautiful and the hydrangeas were unbelievably so fragrant, was just beautiful. Whereas a guy is going to be more like, yeah, it was really cool. And they both mean the same thing. The fact men take a more direct and caveman-like approach, again, comes down to brain function, nothing more than that. Unless, of course, he's distracted by the game on TV. Number three, women revisit memories more than men do. Women will ruminate over a past slight more than men. And again, it comes down to brain function. And it doesn't mean the man doesn't care, but he'll typically say less about something while he is still upset and will move on quicker from it than she will. So if she brings up an argument from four years ago while he can't remember what was for breakfast yesterday, well, that's kind of normal. Number four, women are more tuned into their emotions than men. You see, women have a larger limbic system. That's the part of the brain that controls emotions. So women can pick up on men's emotions even when he is silent. Whereas dudes cannot pick up on hints because they operate on facts and logic. So he isn't a chimp man Z. Well, maybe he is, but it doesn't mean he's uncaring. He just needs things spelled out for him better. Number five, women are also more emotionally empathetic than men. Women brood over another person's issues with empathy while men switch to problem solving mode. This is what can cause men to try to solve her problems and not listen as well when she really just wants to vent. Mansplaining may be caused by this too. So the next time you vent to your guy about your boss, he's mentally trying to solve the problem for you, which is well intended. And yes, he's probably thinking about sex too. Number six, women have better memory power than men. This is different than number three, which stated that women revisit memories more often. This difference deals with how her memories are in much better detail than those of most guys. She has much more detailed memories, so she isn't trying to hang on to past details. Like the time she sent him to the store to buy toilet paper, but he came home with donuts and trash bags. Those details just happen to be at her mental doorstep, whereas men would be grasping for such memories. But somehow men never forget the donuts. Number seven, women may need a variety of factors to all be present to get aroused. Things like scents, visuals, sounds, smells, you get it, the list hits the floor. While men need one simple visual, you, and they are ready to go. But the ladies watching this video probably knew that already. Number eight, 
Women are better at learning languages. Men are better with numbers. There are a lot of exceptions to this, though it is generally true. Women's capacity for detail and more sensual nature can be of use while learning the rhythms and flow of a new language more so than men. Number nine, women are more sensitive to pain than men are. Why this is true isn't totally clear, but since a woman's nerve density is greater than a man's, her sensitivity to pain is probably higher. And hormones also play an important part in this matter. Women also tend to experience the psychological effects of pain more than men, which means that they tend to worry about pain more than men do, which may explain why women do fewer stupid things that can result in injury. It's typically the woman, after all, that's saying, be careful, while the guy's doing something stupid like running over hot coals barefoot just to see if he can. And here's a bonus fact. According to university studies, in women, 84% of the brain's regions involved in intellectual performance were located in the frontal lobes, while the same brain matter for men are found here in the frontal lobes far less frequently. Clinical data agrees, showing frontal lobe damage in women to be much more destructive than the same type of damage in men. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate that and click on that video you see previewed on your screen right now. I hand chose it for you. Thanks for watching.